So the next thing we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna make sure our girth is tight. So while we still got our, our lead rope in our hands, we've got control of our horse. We're gonna come over here, and we're gonna check here, and run our hand here. I might just a hair loose, not too much, um, but I'm still gonna go up just a little bit. Make sure I don't roll that saddle whenever I get up on that horse. You're gonna wanna make sure this is the last thing you do before you get up, just so you know your horse is let all the air out. And now I know that's nice and tight. Make my T-knot again. Come back through, pull that down, and now I've got everything tight, and I know my saddle's not going anywhere. Just gonna put my stirrup back down, make sure my stirrups fit right. It's about right. And now I'm gonna go up here and I'm gonna make my noose knot. So, our noose knot um, is something we do to keep our lead ropes out of the way here at the green. Um, it's gonna allow us to also, whenever we get off, untie that noose knot and then have immediate control while we're on the ground. That way we don't have to use the reins to lead and you know, maybe risk the cause of damage or anything um, to our horse's mouth. So, the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna put the rope around the horse's neck, come back around behind, and then we're gonna make a little loop about like that. And then we're gonna go around the top and you're gonna work your way down to the bottom and you want to go three times around. And then you're going to put that through that loop that you made earlier. That end right there. And cinch it down. And now what I can do with this, I can make it look good and make it out of the way. And you want it about like that. You want just a little, you want to make sure it's loose so that way you're not putting any pressure on your horse's head that you don't want. But you also don't want to let it dangle too much. So after we've done that, I can come back here and I can prepare to get on, up on my horse. So I wanna make sure I have the reins in my hands. I've got them nice and tight. Not tight enough to where it's gonna tell him to back up, but just tight enough to where he knows not to go forward. So make sure your horse knows what's going on. He's ready for me to get on. He knows he's not moving anywhere. If they do move, give them just a second. All right, now my horse is ready. I'm gonna go ahead and put my leg up, get it in the stirrup, hold on to the pommel right here, and push up and push straight up. You don't wanna to pull to the side, you just wanna push straight up. So we're gonna go one, two, three, and then up and over. It's really important that you swing your back leg over. You wanna make sure that you don't hurt the horse or kick the horse, because that's gonna tell him to go forward. Get your other foot in the stirrup, and now you're ready to ride. And then when we dismount, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna hold our reins tight again, and we're gonna swing our leg up, make sure we don't hit the horse, kick that leg out, and hop down. Now you have your reins in your hands, you come up, untie the lead rope, untie your noose knot, and you're ready to go.